Hello everybody and welcome back to another video. Now today I'm going to be giving you guys a little bit of a social media tip and this is something that I have um, found an issue with myself and if you're out there and if you manage any sort of social media accounts on Twitter and Instagram, I'm going to be showing you a way that will make your life a lot easier when you are sharing photos um, through Instagram and you want them to go to Twitter. As we all know, um, when you post a photo on Instagram and you have your Twitter account linked to it, it will not actually um, bring the entire photo over to Twitter automatically. So if you go to my Twitter page here, um, first off, let's just take a look at this photo right here. This is a photo that I posted of a video that I was doing uh, a few weeks ago on February 22nd, as you can see. So a little over like a month ago now, but um, anyway, that's besides the point. So I posted this uh, image here on Instagram and I had my Twitter account link. And this is the tweet right here that Instagram automatically posted on Twitter for me. So you see, it's got the same exact description, but instead of a like inline photo, it only has a link to the Instagram page that would just take you here. So the only issue with this is that it uh, affects your engagement. So when somebody sees this tweet with a link, they're less apt to click on it than if it had a full image here of this image that was on Instagram, that might actually get them to actually click on it. So um, today I'm going to be showing you a way to automatically, whenever you post something on your Instagram page, it automatically go to Twitter with an inline image, meaning that the full image will show up here rather than just the Instagram link. And this is through a service called IFTTT, or If This Then That. It is free, you know, totally free, so you, you know you don't have to pay for anything. But what it's basically designed to do is, as the name implies, If This Then That. So if you do this, then it will automatically do that for you, whatever this and that are. There's a bunch of different services that support this site. One of them is Instagram. So what you want to do is once you sign up for the account over here on ifttt.com, you want to go to the search tab and click on Instagram, or if it doesn't show up, just search for Instagram in the search box and click on the Instagram logo. And one of the most popular apps that they have in here is this one right here. Tweet your Instagram as native photos on Twitter. And this is actually made by Instagram itself. So what you want to do is just click on this and you want to click on turn on. And if you haven't already signed into both your Twitter and Instagram accounts, you're going to have to do that. It will obviously prompt you. So once you've got all of that set up in if this, then that, now what I'm going to do is I'm on my phone here and I've already taken a, you know, just like a little sample photo here uh, for a teaser for this video right here that I'm going to post on Instagram and Twitter. So I've already taken the photo. So I've got a little description written out here. I'm not going to tag anybody. One thing that you want to make sure of that you don't do is turn on this Twitter thing. You want to make sure it's turned off because instead of Instagram posting to Twitter, the IFTTT service is going to be posting to Twitter for you. So you want to make sure that's turned off and just click on share. And now it's going to go ahead and post. And there we go. So now uh, I have this new image posted on Instagram. 